going to make some Builder Bear pyjamas using some old pyjama bottoms, some elastic, some buttons and some binding. You're going to start by grabbing your bear. Remember this outfit we made last week? Well she's going to need something to change into. So take a pencil or fabric marker and just draw around her legs leaving enough room for seam allowances. These want to be, this pattern wants to be quite big. Then just pin so now and you're cut left out with two identical pieces. And what you want to do is pin up the bottom edges and sew a straight stitch along all of them. Just so when you get to pins, make sure you pull them out. So now those edges are neatened up. You want to take some binding matching your pattern and place it exactly where you want on the bottom edges. Make four pieces and stitch them all on. You'll probably want to pin them down as it can help keep them in place. So now you've done that, you have two neat pieces. So now you want to find some elastic that sort of matches your pattern. Cut it just below the width of the piece then cut another one for the other waistband. Here's why you want to listen carefully. You want to place it under your needle and sew the, sew the first few stitches normally. Now pull on your elastic. Then sew the rest normally, but keeping the elastic pulled. Now sew the short side normally, swivel round and sew back the other way, keeping the elastic pulled. So this is what you'll end up with. So now take the two pieces, put them good side to good side, pin and then sew down the two long edges and the crutch area. Turn the pyjama bottoms back round the right way, press and the bottoms are done. Now let's move on to the top. For the top you'll need everything you needed for the bottoms but this time you'll need some buttons. So grab your bear, place her onto the fabric and start outlining her in a jacket like shape. Then cut only cut out. out one this time. Then cut out a square like shape that just covers it. Turn it over and trace the left side of the back of the top onto the square. Don't trace all the way, you only want to trace one side just over halfway then repeat for the other side so this is what you're left with a back piece and then two front pieces which are going to overlap then you want to clear up all the edges so pin and run a straight stitch everywhere you see here next you want to use that same pink binding we used before place on the bottom three edges pin and then sew next place. place everything where it's going to be sewn then use a fabric marker or a pencil to mark where you are going to have your buttonholes. Then sew the buttonholes on. If you don't know how to do this, check your sewing machine manual or do it by hand. Next, place everything where it needs to be sewn, but good side to good side. Then sew around all the needed edges, starting from the two shoulder parts. Turn your pyjama top inside out and put it on your bear. You can use your bear to mark where you need the buttons to go, then just sew them on by hand. And you're done with the whole pyjama set. So I hope you enjoy watching this easy step by step video. I make a lot of these videos for Builder Bear clothes. So I hope you enjoy them. To see all of them, just subscribe to my channel or go on my channel and you can look through the videos I make. So thank you. Bye.